And that's when I knew that this was going to be my new direction. (laughs) The old buildings. I do too. (laughs) It's always changing, but remains the same. I never thought that I'd be here tonight. I'm never gonna fall. What you just watched were four different videos, each created with just one single prompt. No editing, no extra voiceover, just one prompt. VO3, or should we say Google's latest AI, is changing the game in AI generated video. Honestly, I think this might be the best AI video generator released so far. Last year, we got Sora AI from OpenAI. Then Kling AI entered the scene. But when it comes to quality, accuracy, and speed, VO3 takes the crown. So today, I'm going to show you how to use Google's brand new VO3 to generate videos. Let's see if it really lives up to the hype. Nope, this is not a sponsored video. I'm just sharing my honest thoughts with you when I'm trying it, folks. You remember that viral Will Smith Eats Pasta video? Who would have thought AI video could evolve this fast? I made that entire video with just one prompt. That's the power of AI. And now let me show you something cool. If you look closely, the video is insanely detailed. You can even see raindrops on the camera lens. The camera movement? It feels like something straight out of a big budget Hollywood film. And the craziest part? It took just a few minutes to make, with one detailed instruction. Here's the exact prompt it used. It reads more like a paragraph. Every little detail is built right in. And believe it or not, that wasn't a real cooking video. I mean, it's only a matter of time before people start using these to create full-on AI cooking channels. Look at this prompt again. It's super simple, but it even includes a custom audio track with sizzling sound effects. Now here's the thing. If you want great results from VO3, you need a prompt with clear, detailed instructions. Don't worry, I've made a fully structured prompt template and I'll be sharing it for free at the end of this video. So stay tuned. All right, let's start using VO3. First, just Google search VO3. You'll land on this page and you'll see two options. Try in Gemini and try in Flow. Both will let you access VO3. I'll walk you through both. Let's try Gemini first. You'll need to sign in with your Google account and upgrade to Gemini Pro. The good news? You get one month free and you can cancel anytime. Or, if you're a student, you can get up to 15 months free with a student plan. I've already upgraded mine to Pro. Click on video and boom, you're now ready to use VO3. Right now, Gemini Pro users can create 10 videos, each up to 8 seconds without needing points. Let's try something fun. How about a host interviewing a pretty young woman on the streets of New York? If you just type that into the box, the result won't be great. Here's what you should do instead. Open up the prompt template I've prepared, swap out the topic, then paste it into Gemini or ChatGPT, whichever you prefer, to generate a more detailed prompt. Like I said earlier, a good prompt yields good results. Copy the prompt, hit generate, bam, in just three to five minutes, your video is ready. So tell me, what's the most exciting part about working on the new project? It's the new people. I've met so many great people in the city. Pretty cool, right? Now, I actually made a few sample videos ahead of time. Let's check them out. Next up, let's look at Try and Flow. In simple terms, Google Flow is a brand new AI video tool. You type one sentence or upload an image and Flow turns it into a short cinematic clip. It even comes with built-in video editing tools. Flow is powered by three major engines, 
VO3 for video, Imogen 4 for images, and Gemini 2.5 for logic and language. If I had to sum up flow in one sentence, one sentence or image, ew, a mini movie. Click create with flow and you'll see pro members get 1000 AI credits. Now, let's talk about the model settings. There are three, fast, quality, and highest quality. Only the third one, highest quality, uses VO3, which supports audio and emotion level control. And you will see each generation uses 100 credits based on your current settings choosing VO3. So that's 10 videos total for 1,000 free credits. The others use the older VO2. Flow offers three video generation modes. Text to video, just write a sentence or short paragraph and you'll get a high quality eight second clip. This works just like in Gemini. For example, an Olympic skateboarder gets interviewed with a gold medal around her neck. The reporter asks, what's next? And she says, I'm going to sell enterprise software in SF. The VO3 model follows prompts super closely. Even the lip sync is impressive. And what are you doing next? Uh, I'm going to sell um, uh, enterprise software in SF. Frames to video. Upload one, two images, and Flow will animate the in-between frames. This only works with VO2, though. You can also preset camera movement. It doesn't have audio, but it only costs 10 credits per video. Ingredients to video. Upload multiple images and flow fills in the gaps to make a coherent video, even rebuilding visual style. This mode is only available to Ultra members, which costs $250 a month. Yeah, a bit pricey. Finally, there's Scene Builder, Flow's story editor. You can stitch together multiple clips to make a longer, cohesive video. After generating a video, click Add to Scene to bring it into your timeline. Then, use tools like Jump to regenerate a segment starting from a selected point. Extend. Add time to a scene. Once you've built your sequence, hit Arrange to reorder everything. Then export your full video in one click. Just one note, Scene Builder only edits VO2 content for now, so no audio yet. To wrap it up, Flow is not just a video generator, it's a full creative suite. Thanks to VO3's multimodal abilities, you can now generate high quality, emotional, interactive videos and fine tune them scene by scene. All right, folks, I made this full VO3 prompt tutorial just for you to save you time, avoid mistakes and stop you from wasting your credits. At the end of this video, I'll show you my prompt structure template. You can plug in any topic you like, 
just swap out the red box part. If you want the full Google Doc version, just click the WhatsApp channel link in the description. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, follow, and share. It really helps me out and keeps the tutorials coming. Got questions? Suggestions? Want me to explore a specific niche or tool? Drop a comment. I read them all and reply whenever I can. And hey, don't be a stranger. Check back on my channel anytime. You never know where your next great idea might come from. All right, everyone. See you in the next video. Good luck and happy creating. So tell me, what's the most exciting part about working on the new project? It's the new people. I've met so many great people in the city. And what are you doing next? Uh, I'm going to sell um, uh, enterprise software in SF. If you are not subscribed my channel, it's time now.